It's going to be a very unique environment. I'm sure you all heard the news. I just came out like a normal game uh, with all the stuff going on. It's kind of getting hectic, but I just want to stay on the right path. So, With 28 deaths now being reported in the U.S., coronavirus is becoming a greater threat. Today, the governor announced two new presumptive cases in the New Orleans area. With the, with the paramount uh, situation of please stay safe and, and prioritize your health, and well-being and of those around you first and foremost. Right now, what we don't want is we don't want students' time to graduation to be derailed. The NCAA made a sweeping decision to cancel all remaining winter and spring seasons and championships, meaning no College World Series, no Super 6 for gymnastics, and no March Madness. Today I'm issuing a stay-at-home order for the entire state of Louisiana. You know, as student athletes, it's obviously very difficult that we had to have our seasons cut short. You know, we put in a lot of hours to be ready for it. And, and the fact that that had to happen is, is obviously not easy for us to grasp. We always think that this kind of stuff won't affect us and like here we are now. This has been very hard to deal with this year considering we were coming into nationals ranked number one in men and women. I'm so upset and so heartbroken that I can't play the team one last time. Um, I felt like we were starting to play our best baseball. I don't really think there are words to even describe what athletes are feeling right now. I think the best way to put it is just complete shock. So we you know coming home with one or two national titles meant the world to us and now that we can't compete for it, it's just heartbreaking. Um, I think the thing that's keeping us together right now is knowing that this issue is bigger than us and we need to focus on this first. For it to be cut short like that really hurts. Um, obviously we're trying to understand that this is something bigger than us, that this problem is um, affecting millions of people, not just us. To know all the hard work that we put in through the fall and all through preseason is basically feels like it was for nothing and then for our seniors who are left with so many unanswered questions um, the whole situation right now is just up in the air and it could never have been planned like this and we could have never seen it coming so I think right now athletes just feel like they've kind of lost a part of themselves or a part of their identity to something that they had no control over especially when you're a senior and you know that um, every day is not a day more but a day less of your season and then suddenly you get a notification saying that the, the program is, is over. I think this is a time for us all to get together as a community and you know just kind of beat this thing. Um, there's no there's no place tougher than Baton Rouge, there's there's no stronger community than LSU and, and I know that like I said this is a sad time for us all but um, I know we'll bounce back.